Number 1. The Deer Toucher Following photo was uploaded to Facebook and Reddit in June 2021 by a user named Not Slim Shady. He was driving near Owensboro, Kentucky, when he almost hit a deer that was just standing in the middle of the road. He thought it was really weird because he didn't actually move when he stopped his car, so he got out, took a picture, and when he zoomed in he saw this weird spectral man thing sort of stroking the deer like he was just petting it like a dog. After sharing the picture, a helpful redditor brightened the image and... Yeah, it's not pretty. And the really creepy thing is the OP then responded to say, In the brightened image, it actually looks like it's grinning. Number 2. An Invited Guest This entry was uploaded to Reddit by Oopy Spoopy Man with the following caption. After hearing taps and noises from my kitchen, I take a photo and see this. As if this isn't terrifying enough, OP was actually alone at the time. His three housemates were all out and there was nobody else in the house. He checked the kitchen, he checked all the windows, he checked all the doors, he checked all the rooms. Nothing. There was no signs of an intruder anywhere. Their last update was that they were packing their bags and heading out immediately and not coming back. I don't blame them, but I, I think that as a nice countermeasure, they should have also set the house on fire. Just to be, you know, double sure. Number 3. The Scary Door Nessa's Exploring is a TikTok dedicated to urban exploration and ghost hunting. She's got a lot of videos up, so I recommend going and having a look. This one was filmed at a supposedly haunted, abandoned mausoleum. They came across this creepy door. It was opening and closing on its own, and rather than Look, it's opening. just turning That's around, crazy. leaving, and never coming back, they just asked the ghost, or the demon, or the crazy crackhead, or whatever the fuck is doing it's this, open. to keep wow. doing it. Oh, wow. Hello, somebody's in there? Is this human being here, sleeping here? Oh. Wow. Anybody in there? I think they're asking us to come inside. But what if it's a real person? And then they went through the door. You want this? So go ahead and head over them? to Nessa's channel if you'd like to see more of this. Oh, Number 4. Playdate So this is a really interesting one. This one was uploaded to YouTube in 2009. And 11 years later, the original uploader, Tony N, was looking at the video and he noticed that there was a sort of strange girl in the background. That's Tony's three-year-old son, Elijah, Elijah that's hey, dancing to Green Day. Elijah, look it. But the girl in the background wasn't actually there when they filmed this. And I suppose you could probably Elijah, chalk this up to like pareidolia and say that it's just seeing patterns, but the thing is, Elijah seems to notice that the girl is there and stops and definitely looks at her at one point. And in case there was any other question that this is just some weird camera glitch or whatever, you can actually hear her giggling at the 13 second mark. Tony actually popped in and answered a few questions and he, he said some interesting things like, other people who've been in that house have experienced paranormal activity like shadow people and having panic attacks in the same room where the little girl was seen. He also mentioned that after he purchased the house he found out that it was built on an old burial ground. And for reasons that are completely beyond my comprehension, he still lives there to this day. Number 5. Night Stalker So this is a different kind of creepy. This one is of the human variety, which some would say is much worse than ghosts and ghouls and shit. A 22-year-old model named Gusta from Florida had this doorbell cam installed. Her mother convinced her to do it and literally a few days later she came home at uh, 10 past 11 at night, gone into bed and then a notification came through the app that someone was outside. This creeped out Gusta who pointed out that seeing as he arrived literally one minute after her there was a good chance he was following her and knew her whole routine. The police were called but Gusta said that they didn't really do much, just told her to be careful and keep the windows closed. So Gusta and her mother set up their own homemade, home alone style booby trap by tying a rope between two trees. A week later she came home at 2am, got into bed, and moments later 
she heard a rope trap go off. She checked the ring up and she could literally see the stalker staring at her through her bedroom window. Again, the police didn't help much, so Gusta and her mother ended up just moving away. Number 6. Mysterious Walker So you might have seen this video already. It's been going around social media for a while now. It was filmed by two bikers in Jharkhand, in India. And what they're saying is, Witch, witch, stop, record her. When it was shared on social media, most people assumed that it was an alien or a skinwalker or some other kind of being. But the story is actually much creepier. According to Deccan Herald, what you're actually seeing is a naked woman, painfully thin, and either pale or just covered in road dust. And the really creepy thing is that nobody is trying to help her or find out what happened to put her in that situation. They're just saying, she's a witch, record her. Many have speculated about this video and even tagged Elon Musk, but nobody's stopped to think what happened to her. Nobody tries to help. Number 7. Dobby the House Elf I included this one to kind of lighten the mood. As you can see from the video, someone spotted this thing that looks like Dobby the House Elf walking down their driveway. When the story went viral, a reporter from Inside Edition came to the house, spoke to the lady who reported it, and also put her full journalistic might into trying to prove that it was actually just her nine-year-old son with some underwear on his head. Bobby, was that you in the video? No. Are you sure? I'm sure. Definitely. He has an alibi. His mom. She even got him to march down the driveway wearing underwear on his head. And you could tell from his reaction that it's probably him, but strangely his mother backs up his alibi that he was watching TV at the time. Still. I thought I'd just include it because it's pretty funny the way that this uh, journalist goes after this kid as if he's a dictator or the leader of a Fortune 500 company or something. Who do you think it is? Bobby with underwear on his head. You think it's Bobby? It's like, just chill out. Bobby, what do you say? I am not the one in the video. <laughs> If you ever, ever, ever in your life ask the question, what would it be like to be trapped in a haunted Chuck E. Cheese at night in the dark, surrounded by godless, soulless machines horrifically singing this horrible song? Well, there's a man called Connor Lashinsky who's answered that question for you. And if you weren't asking that question, congratulations, you're sane. The caption for his video reads, Abandoned animatronics in apartment, real life horror, secret room. In reality, Connor Ashley collects these old machines and refurbishes them. And these are likely some machines that Connor acquired and is refurbishing. Still, this is straight up nightmare fuel, so I could not include this. So yeah, happy nightmares and thanks for watching. show selector and we'll be happy to do the selection that you've chosen today and remember we do work on tips only so if you'll just come up and pad Rolf's tip jar here I'll see the rest of the guys get their share and uh Rolf we're not supposed to be trying to get tips from people folks uh ladies and gentlemen we do these shows for free we do whatever show you want us to do for pushing the buttons on the show selector Earl I'm sure they'd be happy to tip us Rolf come on can it bruh